Hey everybody, it's Jaren here from GameMeAg.com. Here we are today in the new title update for Many Faces, going for the Steep Dancer 4 achievement. This is to clear stage 4. Make sure you start up a new game on easy difficulty, and then just make sure you get through the first three stages. It should be easy enough as long as you don't get terrible luck on the random drop at the end of the stage. So just make sure you clear out all of the enemies. The stages are going to be randomly generated, so there's no real strategy to it. As for the weapons, hopefully you have a pretty good feel of what they are and make sure you try to avoid anything detrimental to you. So once you do manage to start stage 4, you are going to roll a random boss. Hopefully you get one that's going to be easy to defeat. If not, just try your best until you do eventually die. And then once you do, just make sure you retry. You are going to have to start the game back from the beginning and lose all your gear as the game is going to be a roguelike. So just try your best to keep playing until you get a stage 4 boss that's going to be easy enough to beat. This may or may not take several runs to do, but hopefully in the process you should learn how to play the game and get better at it, or happen to have your luck hold out, and then you should get a run where you get not only good weapons, but hopefully a good enough stage 4 boss who's going to be easy enough to defeat in one try. So just make sure you look for one that you can easily cheese to death, and then once you do manage to clear the stage 4 boss, you should be good for the achievement. Personally, I'm going to recommend you keep playing until you get a boss that's going to have a very exposable weak spot, and then you can just exploit it. And then once you do manage the win, just make sure you wrap up the rest of the enemies in the level. Make sure you take out all of the boss's minions, and then just make sure you open up the chest like normal and then once you load in it to stage five you should be good for the stage clear as well as the achievement that goes along with it also during this process you are going to be able to get the rest of the achievements in the title update as they are going to all be grindy related achievements related to killing enemies and picking up power-ups and stuff so thankfully, the pursuit of the hardest achievement in the update is going to give you the time and space to get the rest of the achievements in the update as well. And then once you finally manage to pull this big one off, you should be good for it. So it's going to unlock right here as we make the jump and load into stage five. There it is. This one's going to be for 200 gamer score. And that's all there is to it.